we think is enough wait time is never enough wait time. So when you ask a question, what do you think about this reading or what's, you know, what's your golden line? I do that as well. And then the three, you know, quickest students are ready. And then the other ones are like still trying to figure out exactly what is the question, right? And processing that. So on Hypothesis or on any collaborative annotation tool online, students have the time and the space to read carefully, to prepare what they want to say. And sometimes the quietest voice in the classroom is the, is the loudest online and you get to hear everybody's voice. Everyone has the space to do it in an equitable way. Um, and I feel like that's the best way for student interaction. I also just know from surveying students and from interviewing that they are done with discussion boards, at least in my experience, it is like the new death by PowerPoint, death by discussion board, post once, reply twice, right? So for especially language learning, if you're interacting with the text and you're annotating and you're seeing the, the lines that you wanna use in your essay later, um, a lot of times the prop I'll use is like, what do you notice? What do you think? What questions do you have? And then they're like, oh, a lot of people have the same question. I don't feel silly that I didn't understand what this part was. And then I can go in and add it in. Um, and so it does allow for students to build that community um, in a way that is not um, like punitive or on the spot. They can take that time um, to respond and they can see each other and interact kind of in a more lively fashion, depending on how you set it up. I don't, um, I don't like police the language or the quality of their responses the same way I wouldn't in a classroom ask people to speak only in complete sentences with, you know, correct standardized English like you like a GIF or GIF, whatever team you're on and how you pronounce it can be just as powerful of a response to a line than a, you know, paragraph written in standard English with, you know, topic sentences. So being able to respond in ways that um, is comfortable for them and that they are, um, that they think is fun and lively really gets people into um, understanding, I think, um, the reading or the document or the chart or whatever, the image um, even more than, than you would in a discussion board in my experience.